Looks like Frost is no good here. Help the water shortage and scalding spear. Snap my overrides corrupted, but I can fix it if I hunt the new parts. Broken watchtower. Sit tight. I'll take care of them.
Should be safe with Znark now. We're coming down! Is everyone okay? Better now, without snap maws prowling around. You sure know how to fight. We saw some of our comrades stuck on the eastern cliffs. They could use a hand too, if you're willing. Okay, I'll check it out. We'll head for the shore on the other side to regroup. Thanks again. We'll get moving shortly. Thanks again. Keep me awake.
crazy place. Now, how do I get to reach the cliff? I should take a look at the bottom of the crane's arm. See if there's a way to move it. to try from a different angle. Don't think I can pull the beam from here. I have to get up higher. Climb up and take a look. of the ten. How'd you manage to do that? I don't know how you did it, but thanks for the rescue. Is everyone okay? His legs snapped against some debris as we were making a run for it, but he'll live. How'd you get stuck up here? A mudslide tore through the village in the last storm. This ledge was just above the flood when we got to it. But by the time everything calmed down, the water had receded, leaving us stranded. And we couldn't leave a fellow soldier behind. Can you make it to the shore from here? We'll manage. I think I saw Natiko in an overlook there. We'll head for her location. She'll know what we should do next. When the mudslide hit, I saw some of the others running towards the metal towers. You might want to check there. Thanks. I'll look into it. Survivors from that overlook. Must be where Natika is. Is he all right? Uh, he will be. <laughs> Can anyone hear us? Where are you? We're trapped. 
in this tower. Flood blocked the way we came in. There's a ladder at the top, but we can't reach it. Okay, I'll find a way to get to you. I need to get to the ladder at the top of the building. Maybe there's a way to cross over from the broken one next to it. Doesn't look like there's a way to swim into the broken building. I need something to get me over the middle wall and inside. Could use my focus here. Looks like it's about to fall. If I give it a little push, I could make a bridge to the broken building. That works. Now I just need to climb inside to get to the top. Should be able to cross over to the survivors from there. Can't hook onto that. There's the ladder on the other building. I can make that jump. Whoa. No! That was our only way out! Who are you anyway? Everyone okay? You're not one of us. Sorry. Yes. We took shelter in here when a mudslide swept through the village. 
But debris blocked the passage we came in through. That ladder was our... To do it? Okay! You should have a way out! Thanks! We'll head to the shore in a moment! Okay. I think that's it for survivors. I didn't see Ken talk on my own. I should head back to Matika. For now. Rest now. Aloy, thanks to you, these soldiers are safe. But where's Kentok? I didn't see anyone who matched his description. Do you know where he was when the storm hit? I was the last one to see him, just before. I told him I wanted to leave this place to pledge my blade to the Chief's guard, but he refused to discharge me from the squad. All Tanakht are stubborn fighters, but Kentok? is more so than most. So I walked out. I was coming back from the opposite ridge when I saw the mudslide. You were coming back to make amends. I must find him. If anyone can survive such a storm, it's him. You said Kentok is your squad leader? I've trained under him ever since I was assigned to a squad. <laughs> He's tough as a shell snapper. Unforgiving as the desert. But... And he taught me to fight for duty, not just gold. To serve something greater than yourself. Yes. And yet he wants me to be tethered to this place, rather than fulfilling a greater purpose with the Chief's guard. You said you wanted to pledge your blade to the Chief. Is that what the Marshals are? No. The Marshals travel the breadth of the clan lands. And act the guard remains at the Grove to defend it and the Chief. But like the Marshals... Only a handful are chosen for such- So, why did Kentok not want you to go? He claimed that the greater honor was to serve my squad and clan. But all we do here is gather supplies for ink. How can that compare to guarding the grove? I wanted to leave this place to pledge my blade to the chief's- But he refused- All Tanakht are stubborn- I was coming- You were coming back- I must find him. You said you wanted to pledge your blade to the chief's guard. Is that what the Marshals are? No. The Marshals travel the breadth of the clan lands. The Guard rem- But like the Marshals, only a handful are chosen for such an honor. So, why did Kentok not want you to go? He claimed that the greater honor was to serve my squad and clan. But all we do here is gather supplies for ink. How can that compare to guarding the Grove? The Chief himself? You said Kentok is your squad leader? I've trained under him ever since I was assigned to a squad. <laughs> He's tough as a shell snapper. Unforgiving as the desert. But my blade is quicker, deadlier because of him. And he taught me to fight for duty, not just glory. To serve something greater than yourself? Yes. And yet he wants me to be tethered to this place, rather than fulfilling a greater purpose with the Chief's guard. So a mudslide did all this? Must have been quite a storm. We've had more and more of them over the last few years. Torrential rain, lightning strikes, winds that rattle the metal towers. But this last one was the worst yet. 
This area used to be as arid as the rest of the desert. The storms have changed all that. There's a water shortage in the capital. Could this help? The wound in a sand is low? Guess we're not the only ones dealing with problems. But unfortunately, no. This water's poisoned by ash blood. Undrinkable as machine oil. The Inker's apprentice in Scalding Spear mentioned you exchange ash blood for water. It's the way of the desert. Where other villages hunt for food or machine parts to trade with the capital, we collect rocks. Important rocks. The clan relies on ash blood to mark their skin. How can they record their glories without our supply? I can take another look around the village. Where did you last see? Natika. I'm here. Where's Kentok? Did he make it? We're going to find him. He saved me. Pushed me out of the way as everything collapsed. But then the flood took him. Towards the gouge. The gouge? It's an ancient passage that leads deep underground. Come. I'll show you. Natika. We need orders. We're exposed out here. Only half of us can hold a blade if machines come. What do you want us to do? Go. The gouge is in the hillside, northwest of here. I'll catch up when I can. What are we going to do now? Let's get a couple soldiers posted as lookouts to start. Understood. in there during the flood. I'm gonna have to clear some of it to get inside. Take it easy. You must be Kentok. Oh. I was an outlander, not my name. Natika sent me to find you. The soldier you saved told us you were swept away by the mudslide. And so, he made it. Good. And Natika. She came back? Yeah. She was on her way back to talk to you when the mudslide happened. She's looking after the survivors now. <sighs> it was. My mistake to deny her discharge. A soldier is supposed to sacrifice for the good of the tribe. Looking back now, she was right. I didn't want to let her go. The chief's guard will gain an invaluable soldier. At least after all this, I won't be in the way anymore. I can tell you know a fatal wound when you see one. My service to my clan is done. So... Leave me. No. You're not going to die down here. There has to be a way to get you out. There isn't. I tried to climb out, but it's no use. The walls are too slick. 
Water's coming in from the surface, but not from where I came in. There must be another source, and if I find it and open it up... You might not be able to move, Kentok, but I think there might be a way to move you. Hey. Hey. I need you to stay awake. I'm gonna take a look around. <laughs> You're just like Natika. Relentless as a fireclaw. And you should be used to it. Just sit tight. I'm going to get you out of here. That waterfall must be coming from somewhere. I need to get higher up to figure out where it's coming from. from that vent. Dead end. There must be another source. Onto that.
Okay. The waterfall I saw down below should be coming in from somewhere around here. Gotta find its source. Water's coming in from there. I can use the fire gleam to break open that wall. And this place should flood. Found us a way out. Almost there. Hey, stay with me. Tell Natika. You tell her yourself. She said you're a stubborn fighter, so keep fighting. Blade answers only to the hand that commands it. He would say that every time we sparred. Sometimes as an insult. <laughs> Other times as a compliment. But I guess he was right. It was always my choice to stay or go. I'm sorry you didn't get to make amends. So am I. What will you do now? I'm not sure. Bleeding Mark has a chance to recover. And once that's done, I could join the Chief's Guard. But I have to lay him to rest first. With full soldier's honors. Aloy, wait. You saved my comrades, somehow drained the entire village. I want you to have this. Thanks. And good luck. Whatever you decide. Tastes 